With close to 400 golf courses to choose from, we looked at all of them to bring you the top 10 public golf courses in Missouri. So let's swing on in. But before you do, you want to take a look at our channel because we're hitting all the public golf courses in each state. And we're hitting the top golf courses in each country and a lot of golf in between. So without further ado, let's zoom in now to number 10 on this list. And this list is constantly changing. This state's got a lot of great golf, so we're gonna constantly make updates to it, but we're gonna bring you at least the top 10 golf courses that we were able to find the best ones. And this is number 10 here. This total of two courses, we're gonna give it to the Cove course here. And that course stretches 6,573 yards with a slope of 139 and a rating of 71.3. It is a par 71. That was built in 1973 and it is a Robert Trent Jones senior course. It's going to move us now into number nine on this list. It's quickly moving us. Let's go right outside Kansas City for the next Top Golf course. And this one's a good one. The course stretches 6,944 yards. It was built in 2001 by Steve Warft and is a par 71 that is a slope of 130 and a rating of 73. It's open year round and has pretty decent rates on golf now, at least under 100 bucks. Now let's quickly move in to number eight on this list. We gotta hit all parts of the state, so let's go on over to the east part for number eight on this list. A well known course in the state, it stretches 7,047 yards with a slope of 131 and a rating of 73.2. It is par 71. That was built in 1995 by Tom Fazio and Dennis Wise. It's going to move us into number seven now on this list. That's a great golf course. It's well known within the state. But the next golf course might even be more well known. It's number seven on our list. We haven't even broken in close to the top five. We are hitting some great golf courses just outside Kansas City. Another great one here. Located in Jackson Township, this par 72 stretches 7,059 yards. It has a slope of 144 and a challenging rating of 75.2. The course is not that old and was designed by famous golf architect Greg Norman in 2007. The course has all the amenities including a driving range, no clubhouse, and restaurant it's been ranked the top 10 public golf course within the state numerous years and has have even moved up a little bit higher in golf digest and other big golf outlets but this is world twilight golf room we're just hitting a little bit of everything but it's going to move us now into number six believe it or not there's six more golf courses better than that one that you can play you're just going to have to fork out a lot of money now because these courses get pretty expensive as we head down to the ozark for a nice 18 hole golf course here just east right there there it is course is a par 71 that stretches 6881 yards a lot of water on this course it is a slope of 131 and a rating of 73 the course is a little bit old at least it's built in 1994 it is benton grass greens is open year round and was designed by famous golf architect Tom Clark. It looked like it had some big updates in 2000 and maybe even in 2017. It's one of the best golf destinations within the state, but it's only number six on this list, which means we haven't even broke. Well, now we've broken into the top five. Well, we're moving now into the top five. We got great golf left let's zoom in now just outside kansas city for a remarkable 18 hole championship golf course you can see right on google map this thing pops out and as it should this course is taken care of very well stretches along 7406 yards with the slope of 144 and a rating of 75.8 this course was a par 72 that stretch that is a Opened in 2007, again by Tom Clark. So Tom Clark's taken over this, this list, and he's well-known throughout most of these states. 
with some good golf. Let's zoom in now right to the middle of the state for number four on this list. Could go a little bit higher on it. It's a well-known course. Sometimes it's put number one on some other people's list. The course was built in 1999 as bent grass green is open year round. It's in beautiful condition as you can see, but it only stretches 6,727 yards with a slope of 133 and a rating of 72.8 few hundred dollars to play this course here it's one of the most spectacular golf courses it's been listed on golf digest and but it's only number four on the list it means we're getting some good golf here so let's zoom in now to our number third golf course just inside kansas city for a long golf course here the course has a lot of history it was built in 1934 by aw tillinass it is a par 72 that stretches only 6,000 274 yards with a slope of 128 and a rating of 70.9 with all this history we've got to push it over into our number third on this list and that goes to show that there's some good golf coming up you got to hang on tight because we still have two more golf courses to look at within the state of and there's some great golf and we already hit some good ones so if you fast forward you probably missed some of the better golf courses i would go back and take a look and we're going to be constantly updating this list periodically. So keep a lookout for more videos to come. The next one is a well-known golf course, Bratson Hills. And yeah, how could you not like this course? Stretching along 7,324 yards. The course was built in 2008 by Chuck Smith. It is a, a great golf course with a rating of 75.1 and a slope of 135. And it's pretty long from those back tees there we got one left we got one golf course left to look at in the state the best golf course it's not too far off from the number two golf course so let's zoom in now to number one on this list and how could you not go wrong with this golf course look at it beautiful two golf courses to choose from we're going to give it to the ozark national golf course here this beautiful one stretches seven thousand and thirty six yards from those back tees and there's just so much to like about it. And if you look at this, this is some incredible footage of this course. $250 to play the golf course, but it does look like it drops down certain times of the year. It was built in 2008 by Bill Quartz. Golf seasons from April to November stretches 7,036 yards. And that's going to do it for our Go list. Fly. Keep a lookout for more videos to come. This is World Wildlife Golf. Go for launch.